<clears throat> Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to today's YouTube video and in today's video I'm basically going to show you guys on how to, you know, uh, um, get your AdBlue site set up. So, uh, since the AdBlue change that happened like a year or two ago, uh, people have been having trouble setting up a content locker onto a template. So in today's video, I'm going to show you guys step by step on how to do it and also how to find templates. So how to find templates, you want to go to your, go to a private window and go to google.com. And once you guys are on google.com, turn off all ad blocks. And then you want to look up the niche you want. So the niche I'm probably going to go for for this video is like free cash app and uh, generator. Make sure to put that at the end. So free cash app generator. And you want to find it. There will be a ton. So let's say this one. So this is how to find the template and it'll say click here. And as you guys can see, this is a pretty good template. So you guys are wanna, gonna have to like ha copy this. You're gonna have to copy this and look up on the internet a uh, resource saver. So once you guys look up resources saver, there's also an alternative called a uh, HT track, but you know this is outdated. Uh, resource saver will actually grab everything so we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna show you guys how to set it up on a uh, incognito you're just gonna go ahead and click allow in private so as soon as you guys do that there we go so now what you have to do is right click inspect element and then you know as soon as you go to inspect element you click these three arrows and you want to go to resources saver so right when you're here you want to click save all resources you can beautify whatever I recommend not doing that just download and it will download everything from this web page and it will save it as a zip so as soon as you've saved it as a zip you go ahead and you extract this so as soon as you've extracted that uh, you want to find just the domain so check the domain borderclick.com we have a borderclick.com right here uh, BC media borderclick cash moolers so check it and as you guys can see it's actually the template so now for the locker you just want to go ahead and go to adblue you want to look up you just go to adblue if you have an adblue account if this is on a different cpa network the process is going to be different say if you're on like cpa grip cpa grip might be easier but this is adblue we're talking about that that pretty difficult and i just got a lead for 17 dollars i got that on video um yeah you can actually make like life changing money off this. Uh, you want to go to visual editor. You want to click build now. And you want to create a new one. So we're going to go ahead and create a cash app locker. Okay so now what we have to do is go and get the code for website. So I'm guessing you guys have made a locker. Uh, so I literally just ripped a locker from the original site. Um, <laughs> that's basically what I did. I'm going to make a video on that soon on how to rip blockers and so once you've got the code you want to go all the way to Visual Studio and then you want to open uh, this in Visual, Visual Studio so alright and then you want to go and hit control F and then you want to look up VAR so as soon as you've looked up VAR it's going to come up with this and you just want to copy this or you can just copy this one by one so copy that key copy that here and then you want to copy this. If you don't copy this, the lock is gonna gonna look weird and it's not really gonna work. So there you go. Now you've done that. These are the highlighted things you want to do. So you just don't. It doesn't matter what gibberish is here. This is literally just completely auto-generated by AdBlue. Uh, this is not. You don't really have to change that. And yeah. So now you can refresh and you can test it out. Uh, test out the uh, template and it should work with your locker and later on I'm gonna make a video on how to rip lockers and make it work with your ad blue uh, because it's this that's like a gate cape that's like a gate kept method and pretty much the built-in ad blue lockers they don't convert as much so I'm gonna show you guys how to do that pretty soon uh, so verify now and as you guys can see this is my locker uh, you can check for sure if you see the sub 2 in the corner and if it matches your ad blue ID so if it matches your AdBlue ID, you're pretty much good. And yeah, 
So that's the video. That's how to set up a uh, AdBlue templates with AdBlue lockers because they made it really hard. It actually took me a year to figure this out. Oh no, it's pretty bad. Uh, yeah, peace out, and I'll see you guys in the next video.